another tool to fight eviction. This week, City Council voted on an ordinance that would provide free legal help. KSHB 41 News anchor Bryant Madrick tells us how this could ease problems between renters and landlords. Ruby Watson knows what it feels like to have the rug pulled from under her. I was working, lived in my place for like four years, and all of a sudden, I wasn't working anymore. Unable to pay rent, Ruby says she was evicted. I moved in with my daughter, and now I actually have a place, but that still took a while because, like, you know, once you get that eviction on your record, no one wants to rent to you. Ruby thinks if she had a lawyer, her story may be different. Councilmember Andrea Boo agrees. It's an unfair situation right now because property owners are overwhelmingly represented by attorneys and tenants are not. To balance the playing field, Boo introduced an ordinance called Tenants' Right to Counsel. The measure provides renters with free legal help to fight eviction and other legal issues between a tenant and landlord. It really benefits the city as a whole because we are saving money in the long run. You know, we are. It will reduce homelessness. It will reduce all type of services that we will need to be providing later on down the road by addressing the situation right now. Boo says attorneys will come from nonprofits, not the city. Federal money will kickstart the program, but the city manager will have to find long-term funding to keep it going. It is a waste of taxpayer dollars to fund an attorney that can't do anything but delay the inevitable. That's Stacy Johnson Cosby with Casey Regional Housing Alliance. The group advocates for housing providers in the metro. We need to use those resources to fund and rental assistance to help the tenant pay for the rent. Johnson Cosby is a housing provider herself. She says the ordinance is overreaching. Now she's looking to sell her properties and get out of the city. But Ruby plans to stay and says this gives her peace of mind. It gives you hope to know that you're not having to fight this battle alone. In Kansas City, I'm Bryant Metric, KSHB 41 News.